So my name's Josh, I'm 27. I travel and take physique fitness photos and I currently live in Midlands. I wanted an app where I could put my progress photos and videos and travel and different collaborations and stuff into one app. And my friend said I should try it out. It's just an alternative to the mainstream apps at the time before it got really big. Uh, so I thought I'd just try it out. Um, and yeah, it just went on from there really. Uh, my favorite joke is probably my bank balance before <laughs> I started OnlyFans. <laughs> What was your bad pass? You um, it was minus a thousand most of the time. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> it's changed my life completely. So, before I started, I was sofa surfing, crashing at friends' houses. I really wanted to travel. So, I was always doing it on a limited budget and kind of missing out on the things that comes with traveling. You know, I missed out cer certain opportunities just through lack of funds. So I found the income that I'm getting while traveling and while taking uh, cool photos and, and different bits of content, you know, it has enabled me to have more of like a limitless lifestyle. Um, I would say Maldives, uh, a bit of tranquility and heat. I like to um, free dive, so they've got some nice coral reefs and stuff around there. So probably Maldives. Um, a few years ago, I went to the Maldives um, and they didn't have any scuba equipment on this island. So uh, I just had a snorkel and, and fins and I, I stayed there for a month and just did it every day and got really into it. Um, so originally I started as a personal trainer. I did a few physique competitions. It was really just to encourage my clients and just to show that I, I practice what I preach. You know, I can also compete and stay in shape and stuff. So that's kind of how it started. And then I kind of progressed into more fitness modeling and physique modeling. And that's, that's how it started really. Um, I train every day. I think doing regular social, social media updates really does help. It kind of, it keeps you motivated and seeing that I'm motivating others and you know, you get compliments and it kind of gives you a boost to kind of keep going. So I feel like using social media as an advantage really helps me keep in shape and train regularly. Um, I've recently finished You. Um, I don't know if you've seen it, it's quite entertaining. It's about a crazy, crazy guy that stalks his girlfriends. Not, I can't relate to that, but I, uh, <laughs> I enjoyed it quite thoroughly. It's quite entertaining. My most overused app would probably be uh, a collage app. I love to, when I've, when I've got like a collaboration of photos for the day, whether I'm traveling or physique photos, I like to just put it all in a collage, kind of some like a quick snapshots um, for my Instagram and OnlyFans. So probably that. <laughs> probably Brad Pitt. Um, from a young age, watching him on films like Troy, you know, he's like a proper gladiator, masculine kind of good looking, one of those guys you just want to be. I think hanging out with him and kind of getting his good vibes would be would be cool. I saw your gladiator Roman pick on your Instagram. I really like Greek mythology and kind of old school gladiators and that kind of look. So yeah, that was a that's a fun photo shoot. One of my favourites actually. Um, I think the biggest life lesson is to really stick to my own dream and not kind of chase other people's. And I was always. Um, aspiring to be like other people and kind of seeing what they're doing but I feel like now I'm kind of I'm really doing me um, I've kind of extracted myself from a lot of old friends that I shouldn't have been hanging out with and kind of really doing what I want to do so I think just being yourself and not being distracted by other people's goals um, so I've just bought a house thank you OnlyFans <laughs> So I'm going to be renovating that and looking at other houses um, in the next few years. So I think that's kind of my next aim is to really invest uh, my money and continue traveling and making great content for my subscribers. I want to say thank you for supporting me and continuing to support me. I'll be making some great content for you. So stay tuned. I've got a lot of collaborations and trips planned. So yes, just stay tuned for that. And thanks again for subscribing.